Hey guys, Dano921 here. Welcome back to episode 3 of my modded survival let's play. Um, yeah, last episode we went mining for a little bit and I decided that, you know what, all these ores, they're really nice, but I don't actually have a way to double them at the minute. Well, I will do soon. Aha. Uh, yeah, I got a bunch of seared bricks, so... I'm gonna want two of these. I already uh, kind of know what I want. Um, I want one of these. And um, that way, yeah, I want one of those. Uh, and I'm gonna want, yep, the controller. And I think I also want a tank, so for that I'm going to need to grab some glass and some coal. Um, I don't remember how much I need, but that should do. So while that cooks up, um, and the other thing that I need is just a bunch of bricks. So hopefully that's going to be enough. Um, right, so, uh, duh, 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 we don't need that in there, don't need any of this. Also, uh, yeah, I did make another chest, I don't know if I did this on camera, but everything was getting a bit cluttered, so I decided to go ahead and make another one. Also, I don't know if I mentioned this, but I may have, uh, so I just want to clear this up. Uh, I may have said something about being able to upgrade the tools, I can't do that, I believe. Um, I believe you need another mod. To be able to do that which I don't think this currently has um, so that's a shame but uh, that means we can't actually upgrade at all so we're gonna have to make new ones uh, it's not too much of a big deal but just sucks uh, right so got a little bit of glass which is always good and just wait for these boom and the last one done right so we can now put those down there and we've got that uh, is it daytime no is it anywhere near daytime no um, there are mobs around I don't know where I want to put this I suppose I could just put it like here for now um, yeah why, why not so it's just gonna be a uh, basic one uh, it's not going to be anything too special. So it's going to just be a tiny, tiny little one. Um, but it should do the job just fine. And yeah, we've got plenty of uh, plenty of stuff. So we're going to want that there. I'm going to put this there. Uh, we're going to want that there. And then... Let's grab some dirt because I want to fill this out a little bit more. That should do. Uh, so we can put the casting basin there, we can put that there. Yeah, we got plenty of uh, plenty of materials this time, that's quite nice. Um, I'm so used to just being able to walk over blocks, that is uh, not the first time I've done that. Quite interesting. So, we now have this, and we do have a bucket of lava which I can put in. Um, a bucket should be decent enough. Um, one thing I do want to smell over everything else is iron. Uh, for the pure fact that we're going to need iron for quite a lot of things. And I can actually make this one higher, can't I? Um, three, six, nine. No, I can't. I need two more to make it higher. Oh well. Um, yeah, so I'm going to be upgrading the... Uh, upgrading to iron straight away with my tools and everything. Because, well, we need some diamonds. Now, what I'm thinking is I'm not going to get um, an iron uh, hammer. Yeah. I am just going to get an iron pickaxe because I don't really want to waste the iron on mid, uh, on items. I'm going to probably upgrade pretty uh, shortly. Um, 
so I'm just going to probably make an iron pickaxe instead of anything else and we have 36 ingots oh it's quite a lot um, so yeah we're going to actually get a decent amount of uh, stuff from this so um, I don't believe I've actually shown you this before so yeah um, also um, how do I make aluminum brass because we kind of need it uh, molten aluminum we need aluminum and copper we do have those don't we yes so I was gonna have to use gold but uh, luckily we can use this so how many buckets was it um, 48 to 16 so it's what three to one I think um, three to one we'll get we'll go for three to one so basically what that'll mean is we can then use some casts which I will get into now uh, we don't have a lot of stone but we should have enough so I need a pickaxe uh, we don't actually have the pickaxe pattern because we didn't need to make it did we uh, so let's grab that let's put those in and we need pickaxe head and I believe it's just pickaxe head binding and uh, the stick yep yep so that's fine um, do we have uh, do, do, do. we've got the tool rod pattern and we don't have the binding but that's not a problem there we go uh, right so I think I'm going to do that. Let's have a look, shall we? Uh, binding cactus. So that will give us jagged, which means when they hit us, they will take damage. Which could be useful. Could be useful. Uh, I'm not certain if I'm going to do that just yet, but I may. Um, right. For the uh, pickaxe head and everything else, however, we are going to need to put it in here and add uh, some stone to that. And then all we need to do is put it on this table and put the aluminum brass onto this and we'll get a cast. Ta-da! So we've got the pickaxe head cast, which we can then actually put back on and turn this over to iron and uh, boom, iron pickaxe head. So that's the only item I think I'm going to need out there for now. Um, also, I think what I'm going to do, uh, this is kind of redundancy, but I kind of want to uh, do it just in case. And that is put that, no, put that there. Because then we can store all our metal ones in this and we should be good. Uh, and then we can store all our other ones in here. So... Uh, one thing that I do need to do is go down here and grab some sugar cane um, because I have plans. So normally I do just go ahead and make, um, you know what, screw it. I do normally just go ahead and make uh, an item out of all one uh, thing, uh, but I've decided, you know what, I'm going to give this a little bit of a try. Now it's not going to be as um, like, what does iron give you? I can't even remember. Um, reinforced. So it's not going to be as reinforced as it normally would be. But it should be fine. So we've done the pickaxe. So I want to get this in jagged right. Um, well, I don't know. I'll we'll have to have a look. What do we get for paper? So if we put paper binding, that gives us writable. And we can do it for both. So do we want to do that or do we want to do that? Um, I think we're going to want to do that. Yeah, let's go for that. And uh, we'll see how well this ends up.
so all we need to do now is go to here and i don't know if yeah we should be able to do it here so pickaxe head that is the iron one yeah uh that and that so we've got a writable jagged reinforced one uh iron pickaxe so it's got iron repair material that is fine by me uh, it's only got 75 durability which this one had 85 so that's a bit of a problem uh, effective durability is 83 Meh. jagged modifier mining speed 6 level redstone so we can get diamonds with this because it's uh, on iron pickaxe uh, and we've got four modifiers for it I would say that is not bad yeah let's have that shall we so we've got a slightly upgraded pickaxe I mean, it's not major but it is slight uh, do we have any more books in here no I took them all out um, so what I can do is once we get to uh, by being able to mine obsidian which will be uh, when we get our diamond pickaxe what I can go ahead and do is put obsidian on this and that will make it a bit harder uh, a bit tougher I think and I think it'll take up one of the uh, modifiers I think it's the tough oh it's not in here it's the um, plate uh, there it is obsidian large plate I think if you put that on there at all it will give you more durability uh, I believe and uh, food so right I am going to uh, head into the little mine that we have and uh, yeah do some exploring and test out our new pickaxe um, so I shall see you in the mine right so I didn't actually get to show you this last episode but I did find an abandoned mine um, you may have seen it marked on my map uh, there um, so if you're wondering where this is it's just down this is the first uh, little cave entrance we went through uh, the entrance is up there and it goes back up this way so this is the first uh, little cut off bit that we went to and I mined some ore and we found this which is quite cool so I thought what we can do is we can go ahead and explore this a little bit uh, so I do want to go ahead and block that up because it's slightly annoying uh, but I don't have any blocks on me currently uh, so I don't know what I'm going to do about that I suppose we can just mine this aha uh, right so ferris that's a good start and that is redstone level so we wouldn't have been able to mine it previously and so was that so this pickaxe does feel a lot faster than uh, than it was well than the iron one is so that is very nice now the reason I decided to put paper on this is because if you um, have the writable trait it actually allows you to put more stuff on it so I can have I don't know an extra like um, an extra speed upgrade or an extra damage upgrade on a sword or, or something like that um, so I just thought it'd be a good thing to test out because Obviously, you do get bonuses if the uh, tool is made out of all of one item. Um, but at the same time, you don't get all the different things. Like this has got jagged and it's got um, writable on it. Yeah. So, you know, there's there's good points and bad points to everything. Um, so I just sort of test this out because I do always go for uh, straight up. Uh, all the same thing for the item and let's just make sure we've got a way out because we don't want to get stuck down here um, right so we've got plenty of coal luckily um, our pickaxe is about to run out however um, luckily I did grab some uh, iron ingots and I've got my crafting bath table so I was prepared so we can hopefully keep mining down here for a little bit longer than uh, than we would have to um, if we didn't have this. So that's quite nice. 
and I know this is just me mining but I kind of wanted to just check out the uh, the abandoned mine now it doesn't seem to be a whole lot here which is a shame um, I was kind of hoping that there would be uh, monsters and stuff and that is the entrance to the new cave so in that other uh, in the cave system I also found a entrance uh, I just mined some ore and I found this so while I'm here I might as well go ahead and explore this see if there's anything cool down here and this does go on down even further so okay so that uh, that ends up splitting off this is a massive massive cave system this is insane I forgot um, because I've been playing modded for so long I haven't actually been exploring caves and stuff and I forgot how big they actually are it is insane how cool they are because they they just branch off for miles and miles and miles they could po well possibly they could never actually end um, if you get lucky enough with the uh, world gen you can find a cave that doesn't ever actually end I don't know if it's possible but I think it would be uh, right so what I think I'm going to do is instead of mining everything I'm just going to have a quick look around here now um, just so that you guys don't have to sit here and watch me mine every single thing that I come across um, so what have we got down here okay so there's nothing really down here but there is that um, is can we go any further we can man this place is massive and there's lava so I'm gonna grab that in my bucket because um, that is why I brought it so let's grab that up and we'll put a torch down so this cave system is stupidly stupidly insane um, I'm never going to explore the entire thing ever it's just too big um, I was kind of hoping that we would find some chests and stuff in this abandoned uh, mine but it doesn't appear that we're going to which is a big shame I would have liked to uh, find some cool treasures uh, maybe even a diamond a diamond would be so useful right now and there is a chest down there and I will be going for it there's also a lot of cobwebs so probably um, poisonous spider spawner now I don't actually have a weapon on me uh, I didn't think about that did I um, what do I do about that Uh, I ignore it, that's what I do. I'm just going to go over here. Ignore the creeper. He's, he's going insane. Um, oh crap, that I can't ignore. No! You naughty, 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 naughty creeper. I don't know what to do, I can't get down. Um, oh, screw it. Come on, there we go. Right, we can do this. I'm never going to remember how to get out of here, but we can do this. Right, uh, iron, steel. Ooh, apprentice ring of Perdicia. Nice. Cold coke, not anything really massively useful, and the chest is now down there. I'm going to go for it. Uh, this might be stupid, but I want that loot! And there's not really anything of interest. Pile of ashes, some shears, some steel shears actually. That's not too bad. Um, but other than that, we didn't really find anything that useful. Uh, so our endeavour was not very good. Uh, that's a dead end. So let's go and have a look over here. Now I am using all the cobblestone 
that I'm getting, which is which sucks because I do actually need cobblestone. Um, yeah, so I don't know what I'm going to do about that. I think I might have to just go mining for cobblestone. Just like purposely go and collect a bunch of cobblestone. I hear a slime. There's also spiders. Uh, I am not equipped to deal with those for right now. The slime though. The slime I would like to get for the slime balls. Bugger off, bugger off. And my pickaxe is broke. Uh, yeah, I'm going to back out of this. Um, so, let's do that. No one can get in that side. Let's do that. No one can get in that side. And let's repair our pick. Alright, we should be good now. Die. Yeah. So, we're doing a decent amount of damage. Um, I'm just going to grab this. So, I think I'm going to leave that for now. Uh, I don't feel like I'm well equipped to actually... Uh, manage this area plus i don't want to go too far because i'll end up getting lost um because i'm not exactly the best at navigation so i'm going to go ahead and start heading back to base and if anything interesting happens um i'll be sure to let you guys know you know what i decided to uh venture down this little cave system near the entrance and figure out what's down here because I did kind of say that we needed diamonds and well diamonds are what we're going to be searching for so uh, that was a skeleton I do not want to be uh, by lava while he's shooting at me right die oh crap 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 die die da 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 nice forgot about eating um screw you back so you come back yeah screw you um so this looks quite promising down here uh let's just do that for now and that apparently Okay, so this lava's not disappearing. Um, okay, so we'll just have to work around that. Not a problem. I do want this redstone, though, so that's going to be rather nice. Now, it'd be cool if you could put, like, have a redstone handle for your, um, for your weapons, but I don't think that's actually possible. Uh, what? Why? We're on level 12, so what I may end up doing, you know, is just mining in a straight line down here try and get some sort of um, diamond well I couldn't have uh, well yeah I'll take that I don't think I could have said that at a uh, at a better time so yeah we got diamonds great um, that now means that we should be able to mine obsidian now the question is, I've got a question, but I'm going to meet you back at base. Righty then, so we are back at base and I have that one question that I wanted to ask. Uh, and that question is, if I put this in here and I add the diamond to it, that should make it yes mining level obsidian so instead of wasting um instead of wasting three diamonds which would leave me with one i'm going to use one diamond which will leave me with three um because that's going to give me a basically a, a diamond pickaxe now it's not going to be as good as a diamond pickaxe but hey you know it it's diamond um, so our durability is going to go up by an absolute crap ton um, as you can see and you know what what I'm gonna do before I do that is I'm gonna repair it with iron 
because once I do this, I will um, have to repair it with... Actually, will I? No. That's still iron repair. Oh, oh. I'm actually really excited about that. That's very, very nice. Because um, I thought with it being, uh, with it having a diamond on, we may have to use um, diamonds to repair it. Apparently that's not the case. That is absolutely wonderful. So I'm just dumping everything at the minute. So we've uh, we've had quite a good day. Um, we've made a smeltery. We've filled it with iron, like ridiculously filled it with iron, and we're going to actually fill it up some more. Um, how much? So we didn't even use the first bucket. That's good to know. So we've got a decent amount of iron now and we've got a pickaxe that can go ahead and mine obsidian. So what I'm going to go ahead and do is probably between episodes I'm going to get all the ores. I'm going to chuck them into here, smelt them all up and pull them back out. Uh, turn them into uh, ingots basically. Uh, and I think next episode we may have to uh, start getting uh, getting some other stuff going. I don't know what yet, but we are going to have to get some other stuff going. Because we can't just sit here with a smeltery for the entire modded Let's Play, considering it is modded. Um, but yeah, so that's going to be it for this episode. So I want to say thank you for watching, and I shall see you next time.